Welcome to the Book of Remembrance. This message was received from the Lord Jesus on April the 24th, 2016. The title of the message is, You are Lion's Cubs. And the Lord Jesus began, The fight is not over, my brides. Do not give up. You are at the end of a battle that you must see through to the end. Yes, I know fatigue has set in, and you are weary of waiting, but until I come and call you up to myself, keep fighting, keep walking, but remember to always be ready, for I return to you sooner than you think. As for my cubs, you have been lulled into an enchanted sleep. Sin feels so good to your flesh. You have been in it so long that you have decided not to give it up. I have warned you repeatedly that you are being deceived by the evil one. All he wants is for you to lose your soul. And right now, his goal is to make sure as many of my children as possible are left behind after the rapture. Once you are left behind, he will hunt you down and try and break you so that you may lose your soul forever. This is not a time to be asleep. Wake up, my children. Wake up. Can you not watch with me one hour? I am almost here. This is a final warning. I want you to be ready. I want as many of my children as possible to escape this world when I return. Be ready. I will come for you even if you have only been in my field one hour. I am coming to take you home. To those I have given assignments, ministries, I am here to tell you, hurry up and finish your assignments. Fulfill all your duties, for there is no more time to waste. Yes, there are some assignments that will come into fruition and be completed when I return to rule and reign for a thousand years. But there are some assignments that I have given you that must be completed on this side of the rapture. Do not get weary, lazy, or give up. Go ahead and complete them. Remember to minister to your loved ones. Leave them informed on the coming rapture and on the events that will occur after the rapture during the tribulation period. Tell them not to accept the mark of the beast. Tell them to call on my name and I will save and rescue them. Leave them well informed. Leave behind letters full of instructions, scriptures, and love. Share my love with them, for it is my love that will draw them into my arms. This truly is a time of preparation. For my brides, you are preparing to come home. Therefore, leave everything in order. Do not let that day catch you unprepared. Every morning when you wake up, make sure you are ready to leave this earth, if I should show up that day. That is the attitude that I want all my brides to have, to be ready day and night, for you know not when I will suddenly appear to bring you home. As for my cubs, I give you the same instructions, but because you are all about the flesh, I will cut you unprepared. My greatest sorrow will be to leave you behind. Can you imagine what you will feel when you see me in the clouds departing with my bride and you are still standing feet planted on the ground, not able to fly up to me? For you are aware of the rapture, and on that day your sorrow will be great. Once you see my bride and I gone, then cry no more. It will not make a difference. I will not return for you. You must live into the tribulation period. Go home. Repent. Pray. Fast. Find all your loved ones who are also left behind. Go to my word and inform them of what is to come. Stand firm. Do not despair. You are a lion's cub. You are strong and your might is in me. Stand up tall and proud and get ready to face many trials, tribulations, and persecutions. Remember, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. Be wise. Do not accept just anyone into your fold. Cast out the marked ones and spend your days ministering for me, testifying of me, bringing others into my fold. Some of you will be killed for your faith, so prepare to die for what you believe. I am with you. My Holy Spirit is also with you, for without Him, you would not be able to stand the coming massacre. My sorrow for leaving you behind will be turned into joy as I watch you march victoriously into my arms, having overcome all. Once again I say, you are lion's cubs, and I am the lion of Judah, therefore you are my cubs. You have nothing to fear. You are kings and conquerors. Go and spoil the enemy's camp and expand your territory of influence. I am with you always, the Lion of Judah. Jesus. Amen. 
And that was the end of the message from the Lord Jesus. Be blessed, beloved.